Hello everyone, so do you want to see some large scale Russian losses? If so, then you're in luck here. This video shows 16 newly confirmed Russian vehicle losses, all of which were destroyed during the same push during a few hours of each other. Now, this isn't the clearest video. It's heavily edited with lots of cuts and effects and that sort of thing. But it appears that a large Russian column was attacking near Klishchivka, which is near Bakhmu, and then got hit by a combination of Ukrainian drones, artillery and mortars, leading to a number of them being destroyed. This includes mainly armoured fighting vehicles, but there's a few tanks in there as well. Now, as this video is very choppy and hard to make out, I'm going to go through some screenshots of the losses before I get to a geolocation. There are 16 vehicles in total. Likely more, as not everyone will have been videoed or photographed. In this first screenshot, there are more wrecked vehicles than there are Zeds on the screen. Nine vehicles in total here. All of them BMP variants and all wearing their best Fedra for the occasion, except for one solitary tank, which is highlighted in the red box. Judging by the video, these look to get malleted by artillery whilst advancing towards Klischievka. On this screenshot, just two new vehicles are seen, an abandoned BMP-3 and a T-80. On the right hand side of the screen, you can see one marked old. That one is an old one already on war spotting, so not part of this recent failed attack. This image, most of these are ones we've looked at, they were in the first screenshot, but there are a handful of new ones. Four BMPs highlighted in the red boxes, and a cloud of smoke from something possibly burning, but we can't tell what. Here, three of the vehicles, including the two BMPs spooning, we've already seen but the tank now spying on them spooning is new. However, I'm not sure if this was destroyed. Here, two screenshots above each other. The area to focus on is in the red box in the lower image. So on the lower image, you can see that the tank is gone, and instead, there's an abandoned BMP there, which isn't visible, on the top image. So, the top image, I think, actually occurred first, with this tank possibly being damaged, but was then repaired enough to crawl back with a BMP then arriving later and being disabled nearby. So that final tank, I don't think we can class it as a loss. So the number of destroyed and abandoned vehicles here is 15 by my account. Here are the locations, geolocated on Twitter by IMI. The blue are BMPs, the red are tanks. So mainly, BMPs destroyed here, but we have two tanks also making an appearance. Not shown, on this map is a previous wrecked one that we saw, and the tank which likely made an escape as it disappeared. Here, zoomed out, you can see it's south of Bakhmu and north of Klischivka. Klischivka was liberated by Ukraine early last year, so this is an attempt by Russia to capture Klischivka again, or, at the very least, Ukrainian positions in order to launch another push at Klischivka to recapture it. This attack clearly failed miserably. Here it is zoomed out so it's on the eastern front. So that's it for this video. Now before you finish, Rebirth Energy, who we've raised money for in the past, has started a new fundraiser. Now, a quick apology, as I've been doing a lot of fundraisers at the moment, but it's all helping out in a difficult time, as Russia is having some decent momentum at the moment in the east. This request is for a buggy for the 4th Operational Support Brigade National Guard. The donation info is in the description. Big thanks to everybody who can help out. So that's it for this video. Thanks so much for watching and take care everybody.